Uh, I'm watching through Axe Corps. I'm doing okay. I got you, got you. Yeah. Gotcha. I just gotcha. figure the less I'm streaming to other people, the better. So. Okay, okay. Uh, we have ocean in the room. Yep. How the heck do I spectate? I just press this button. Oh, I did it! <laughs> this is how often I use spectate. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and here we go. Yeah, I know Ocean's got work soon, so we need to get this moving. And what, then... what, what a guy. What, yo, Ocean, you're a hero right now. You, you're maybe, is your priority? I approve, 100%. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's see this. So maybe this is Johnny. Huh? These are first to seven, right? It's the or first ones it? are first to five. I'm not doing oh, first okay. to seven everything. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Uh, we're not getting the intro. I'm sad. But also, Ocean's on a time limit, so. Yeah, I was going to say. It's an interesting matchup, in my opinion. This is like a long debated matchup. This is Johnny's favorite and May's favorite. <laughs> Hitting with the classic 5D. I like it. Six age goes on block. Oh, stunned. Oh, my God. This is the thing, man. Like, Johnny has to, like, his buttons are they're quick, but, like, for whatever reason, they're very prone to just getting hit by May buttons. That's kind of how I would describe it. Well, it's like, not only are Johnny buttons quick, they have good range, which make, which can yeah. make the neutral game hard. Yeah, the thing is, like, May has the mobility to move around to where Johnny can never catch her. Like, what? Well, not never is, like, the right word, but, like, it's a thing, right? Like, actually catching May is a thing. So. I'm going in for standard mayor. Yep. Oh my god. Quick set, or quick match, I guess. We're yeah. running through these sets. Mm. <laughs> Speed run. Go three hour stream. Come on, three hour stream. Three hour. <laughs> well, the problem is that uh, I know Vulture's at work, so he's not going to get back to like four. So we're here for a while. Oh, yeah. Yeah, May Cry's, May Cry's good. I know these two fought in North America, South American tournament. Um, yeah. So, and I think May Cry did take all the rounds. Uh, Ocean does well against me. Like, he, he's learned my habits and it's good job. So, let's see how he adapts in game two. Burns. Yeah, I'll just go first. Quite hating early. It'd be a very different momentum switch right here from Ocean here. Let's see how he fares with Loki, but. Top the jump. Big pressure. Ooh, yeah, that was a missed force break dolphin in the corner. The big combo. thing about this matchup, though, right, is that all of my Johnny player friends will say that May is actually super easy to, uh, to Nikasu, right? Nikasu, that's the word, right? The one hit? I think yeah. it is. Because it's like. I'm trying to remember. In Senga's the overhead that they like to do. Yeah, yeah, but like the set of it is called the Nikasu, I think, if I recall correctly, where it's actually the one yeah. hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really get one hit, yeah. Yeah, we're seeing o o Ocean a lot more patient now. Or at least just getting his bearings and able to play that neutral game. Level 2 and mirror on deck now. Let's see if he's gonna make something work here. Mm. Yeah, unfortunate. That's a good one. Ooh, that was a missed punish there, that overhead kiss whiff. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That goes on. It's unfortunate. Yeah. May Cry definitely does a lot of jumping with May, that I've noticed, compared to some of the others. I've, like, I've definitely found Mays that are more grounded. Oh, you're wrong. Yeah, that's all Put a J in the magic. chat. Gets the super. Oh, nice counter in the Oh, yeah, 6p, and I think, I forget what. Yeah. Thanks for the follow, uh, Speth Patina. I see six vertical golfing. Just for the mix. I foresee dolphin into a little juicy combo. Oh no, oh, that's those are always always punish killer joker. <laughs> always punish killer joker. Kiambra, your choice is the May player or the real life May. Those are your choices. So that is 2-0 for May Cry, but already we're seeing good adaptation for motion. We can keep up that uh, adaptation rate. You can definitely turn this around. Hey, getting the hits, just that's how it goes, right? Show me private. 
Bro, Johnny. Dude, when I was playing Guilty Gear, I just fought nothing but Johnny's. There's so many Johnny's in the scene. <laughs> the sea of... Dang, the Zelfin's getting in there. Ooh, I think that could have been a corner combo and possible dust, so they got the up dolphin. Probably looked for something simple. Probably wasn't expecting to counter it right there. Oh yeah, oh she's getting caught by the six H's. Everything is going now. Uh, is way out of right now. <laughs> Alright, here we go. There we go. Yeah, of course the immediate interaction from uh May cry. Okay. Nice punish. Give him 5H. Nice punish. Nice. I feel like that's. I feel like it's like. I feel like Johnny kind of has to play around May, but if he can do that, it, it's fair. It's hard for May. Like I said, I think the biggest issue is that at a certain point, Johnny will be able to link costume May like every single time, and then you just kind of like, if you get hit, you just die. <laughs> like, that's literally my experience when I was when I play like other Johnny players. I was like, oh, this match is pretty rough. Like, May more or less should be able to play a neutral, not, but Johnny's still really good at it, right? So it's like, like, Johnny gets to play ultimately at a certain point, that's where the matchup gets really, really difficult for May, in my opinion. But like the thing that you know, I'm saying too, like, Mikra is just in a position where Johnny's just not able to land those clean hits, right? He's hitting May, but he's not landing those hits that lead to the Akasu. Oh, which is the super. Yeah, you got to put those J's in whenever he lands and then put those F's when he doesn't. That's what I expect from you, Chad. Is that burst going to pay off? No. Oh. It's also one thing too, I think Johnny's one of the other characters that can actually really murder me for a 3k and a 3k. Oh, you are right, Maycry is all about taking the disguise. Oh no, three connects. They're gonna the miss. It's forcing the interaction, yeah. Just to confirm on the 3H. He made 3 kills in this matchup. He also gets you killed in this matchup. Alright, Ocean on the board. Like, I think it's just nice. like that first game was just like, oh my god, make buttons. <laughs> that he's quickly, he's, he's definitely got getting his bearings, and I think I have gotten them at this point. Yeah, he's just done warming up. He's like, no, I don't want to go 05 to speedrun to work. Very aggressive start. Oh. Maze backdash being the classic that it is. Oh, my 6H is in the vertical ball, but you're getting all of those. I miss those sometimes. <laughs> I've been playing May forever. Oh! That's insane there. Do you like the use of 2D in this matchup, actually? I'm trying to... I'm definitely a big fan of May Hoops, and like recently I've been really playing a bet with like defensive P Hoop. It just gets in the way of so many things, like Faust items. Yeah, hooping is actually like one like one thing I used to like kind of play right off of a long time ago, and then I finally clicked and I was like, wait, this move is actually ridiculous. And then once I got when I saw the plus R, I had the D hoop. I was like, this is actually kind of not fair. Like, I don't like. I almost feel like May can't have a bad match because she has D hoop. Nice hard slash pressure. Oh, nice backdash from Ocean. The dolphin right back in! Getting pressured. I think Johnny's also three yards stun too. Oh, you can do three on Johnny? Mm -hmm. Today I learned Johnny corner loops. I don't know, if I was Ocean, I would have 100% bursted, because, yeah. Before it got to that health deficit. Wait, nope, yeah, nope, no, wrong sword, wrong sword. Right? 
maze combos are super just you can basically you can basically burst them whenever you want. There's very few burst save points. Maybe he was hoping for uh what's it called? Uh for him to drop like stop the combo, right? Oh true. The burst but I mean like like I said, like I think most main players just know that their combos are just super burstable, so they just let it rip, I feel. Yeah, 5 HB in the goaded button. They're all matchups, in all honesty. There's, there's very few matches where that matches like that, but it's not like it could be an answer to something. Oh, the point's looking to hit, yeah. Aw, oh, the coin. Ooh, good punish for the overhead kiss. Ooh, I've nice definitely used overhead kiss enough on Ocean that he knows to look for it. It's actually one of the better moves in this matchup. I mean, if you actually just want to like, raw dog your way, because this is the way his, his moves don't have enough active frames to really just deal with it. So he has to like call it out like other buttons or delay his poke in general. Yeah, I know like Johnny's 2H, I want to say, is really good at any little gap you have in like your pressure. Boom! That Ooh, thing's yeah. just gonna hit you! That is a 5 frame move, it'll definitely do that. A big Santa dream. Nice. Ooh. Very like, nice comeback. Overhead kiss in full frames being in full frames. That's why, like, I think that the, like, um, uh, the matchup, like, it feels awkward for Johnny players on this, but they have to switch the buttons they use in this matchup to deal with a lot of the games. And the thing is, like, even if the buttons they switch to, they're still really strong in this matchup. Like, using D, but 2D is a really strong contender for just really trolling maze wins. Oh, oh, that's the confirm. I like that use of D-hoop to force Ocean forward. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, I know bursting against Johnny combos is, is like, you gotta really be careful, otherwise they're just like, oh, I'm just gonna kill you, so. Yeah, some nice Johnny damage. Johnny's so cool. Oh no, Pulsar, are you still in the room, or? Definitely, technically. Okay. It's like, I don't think we want her back, so we connect. Yeah. Heaven or hell. Duel. Yeah, round start against Johnny, I found. It's hard to really get buns that are going to beat his unless you, like, predict what's coming. Because he just has that yeah, range yeah. of speed. Yes, he's 5k and some of his slashes are very, very far range. Ooh, yep. Doing a good job, like, definitely seems like for Ocean right now, like, his thing needs to be anti-airs. And not getting hit by stupid things like that. <laughs> Six H me increase. Oh, nice Divine Blade. Ooh. Ooh, the throw tag! <laughs> Damn, Ocean! Ocean's going for it now. Like it's seeming like it seems like now we've got kind of like a relatively even neutral game, but I think like Ocean's combos are generally better. So in an attrition battle, he's winning. Yeah, if I was Maycry, yeah, that, uh, I think you kind of have to burst there. You might be able to backdash and escape, but when you have to, then he has the unblockable setup. Setup, eh. Nah. Ooh, 
the FRC. Aw, oh, drops the combo. Doesn't get the good Oki. Oh, with 6H. Oh, no. Oh, that nice throw. throw. The Roman cancel unblockable. Sets up the unblockable. Be the beginning of the end for our major. Oh, okay. Yeah, you just, I just fast forward to the end of this one because this fight might be over soon. Yeah. Ooh, they up that 2H right there. Any gap. Any gap. Nice. You can also use on a reaction to a lot of situations too, especially all the, the May hole charges, right? So fast and so far. Oh, yeah. Ocean is bringing it back. It is even. Very nice now. adaptation. Yeah. I guess we won't have a three hour stream anymore. <laughs> yeah. Nice throw. Good throw. Can he get the avocado? Come on. Unblockable. Gets the. J I want to see oh those Jays in chat. Oh. See here. This is a. Oh, Thank avocado you. denied. So yeah, Jackout definitely has uses for combo extending or getting yourself into some like some of the classic like bread and butter routes. Unfortunately, Maycry wasn't able to get much off it. Still though, a lot of damage to that little sliver of health. Oh, nice back dash. I was gonna say like this could have go getting on. It's still very doable because the coins are off the table. Oh, the six H and a knockdown. I like the way that Maycry is using these slash dolphins to kind of like not overcommit with some of the move some of the vertical dolphin movement. There probably are some Oh a throw tech, nice. That is like two throw techs this set now? Yeah. Oh. Ooh, it didn't nice combo. You went for the slash back? And Maytry brought it back. All right. This is very even, more even than I expected. Yeah, well, like when we saw them in North America, South America tournament that I hosted. Oh, um, like Maytry, I think took every round. One, two, oh. Ooh, good throw. If I if I'm Ocean right now, I want to take that burst as soon as possible. Like, I want it off the table. Another J! A super. Baycry holding out on the burst. Oh! That was painful. Not giving Ocean the chance to really slash back it. Oh, Ocean being really slippery. This is last, this is the last set. Let's see here. I think like I think we're at a point where the burst is not going to save Maycry. Like it's probably going to end up like go th another throw tech. Three, three tech throws down. There you go. Ah, uh, they get the micro dash okay. I mean, could always use as a gold burst, right? That's always another option. Yeah. Right? Oh, okay. what? Just, like, super jump. Come on! Oh, that should have been a kill. I should have been a force break into a kill. Oh my god. Oh, there it is. That is May Cry. One game away, but. Whoo! <laughs> Broke Johnny. Well, yeah, after all, it's May who gives Johnny his allowance. <laughs> Apparently. Saying May's an accountant of the jellyfish. Looks like what's going on. <laughs> oh! Come on. Oh, nice back dash on the flash. Okay, a lot. Okay. I, I, Johnny's got to be pretty stunned right now. Not like the red flashing, but like 6P, some of those like JH and stuff. Johnny's tough on the stun, dude. That character takes forever to stun. Yeah. It's those abs. And like Ocean's got enough hits to like where it's not just continuously getting stunned. Yeah. That's just young table. Ooh, oh, a good block. Good. 
I wonder if that was actually cross up protection. Nice. Can't tell you're finally. Oh my god. Oh Very my nice god. Ooh, violent round start. Man, nice pitches of ocean just letting that me just work around. <laughs> oh. Impossible dust, let's go! Oh my god, she's getting it. Yeah, but know that like Maycry was able to like see how the dolphin hit the wall for that second one to know that it, that he wasn't gonna get a third. So that's why he like went for the jump instead of trying to continue the combo. Is that something unblockable? Nice. <laughs> Ocean in, in. I wonder if it would have been worth going for a. Uh, uh, the whale. I think that's the first whale it. of the set. Yes. Alright, we are 4 4. Holy shit. What a start. I feel like Ocean is about to go like late to work so he's like trying to speed run this <laughs> yeah <laughs> speed run to work and it goes all nine games all right this is the game that decides it all what do you think maycry needs to do to close this out i think he's playing oh, fine it's just, i think ocean's cool. actually the one that's like he's playing from behind he's catching the hit so like the adaption, I wonder, I wonder what it would be. I think Ocean is, is catching the reads, right? He's using those up and spiders to chase me down and stuff, right? So, I mean, unless maybe uh, Maycry is being a little bit predictable with his movement, then Ocean's got to beat on what he's doing. How many chases to spend this set? Uh, five or six. It's been a lot. Dust tube. Ooh, that could have probably could have been like a, like bread and butter stuff there from that. I missed the conversion. Uh, yeah, he's holding. Yeah, he's holding the other ones. Yeah. Ooh, nice good here. Yeah, that seems to really be like Ocean's thing. Like he, if he can't get the anti airs, he is screwed. I mean, we called it earlier by we saying, you know, Meek is very much in the air the whole time, right? So Ocean's just definitely just going. Okay, I'll just check the air. So yeah, I think maybe the play here is to probably play more of a grounded game and just kind of make him like and guess the way he votes. Or just dash at 6 feet, that's always a good time. So yeah, we got Ocean here on set point using his burst. If he loses this round, that is not going to be good. Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that was risky, man. He could look at and response to it. Yeah. Oh, is that gonna kill? All yes. right, one <laughs> round yeah, away. Ocean, I think, is gonna get burst later in the round, but Maycry's got it ready to go. That's one coin, two coin, three coin. Ooh, I think Maycry's getting desperate. Very nice conversion. Oh yeah. Forget if May can beat the dead angle with this XP or not. Ooh, is that gonna be the kill? Yo. That's the kill. There it is. Nice. Ocean taking it 5 4. Against Ooh. all odds. Damn. That was cool. That was a good He's set. Saying, yeah. You know, you... <laughs> Ocean with the nice adapter towards the end, right? Kind of keeping a. Yeah. May cry off. Out of the sky, basically. What a nice set from both players. Yeah, absolutely. Five four. That was that was beautiful. Luck surprisingly quick too. <laughs> <For real. laughs> yeah. Well, it's but, like they're both like confident in what they want to do, which so they're not like playing. Yeah, time to run to work. <laughs> Have fun at work, Ocean. So yeah, let nice me go ahead and get the names changed. Um. So yeah, all of so yeah, I think um yeah, Ocean I think is um southeast for Southeast United States, 
May Cry Brazil. And so now we got Olive Oily from the Netherlands and then Athena, another European player. I'm not sure where from, but yeah. Let's see. Olive Oily, Oily and Athena. So what's your thoughts on the uh, Dizzy matchup for May? I think oh, it's Denmark. okay. So if you, if you want my thoughts, or typically you can really just rush and roulette her if you really want to, basically, right? Like the way she needs to poke are very prone to getting being out by her five. Like Dizzy two K will lose the five K. Dizzy or yeah, 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 Dizzy five K will also lose the May six P. So you could just start running at her, making just RPS every single time and heavily in May's favor. But of course, neutral is not that easy. Just running, no May running or not Dizzy just running around. It can be a pain in the ass to chase her down. But I feel like it's not a bad matchup for May. It's to me, it's completely fine, right? You have hoops that's opt her to like the controller from like just summoning fish randomly. So there's plenty of places that where she can position herself. So, let's, but I'm curious what's gonna, how this is gonna go. Here we go. Yeah, it's definitely. It's like I think like what helps May is her mobility and the fact that she has like massive stun. Yeah, like Dizzy could stun like, just randomly and very abruptly. Uh, the problem is like you also can't jump on Dizzy <laughs> with two X. Yeah, that's old cool, school. Cool. That is an old school set of ever seen one. <laughs> First dolphin. This is also a very loose situation though for me, with no reversal option at all. Kind of is a best block. Yeah. Um. Oh my Jesus. Yeah, I can't it's interesting because yeah. I know like these two fought in a tournament before. Only won that set, and I think in a casual like setting they went about even. Mm -hmm. and I, but I know like what I've heard is Olive Oily. She can very much like change what gear she plays at. So competitively, it's like she ramps it up. I have not mm -hmm. heard the same for Athena, but so we'll have to see how the set goes. Thank yeah, you to play those lows. Yeah, Olive Oily's got very good execution. Uh, that is definitely probably one, like, she, she she can get, it's like, getting hit by her is very scary. Oh. Also, that's a game too, right? Uh, May being a girl is actually kind of tricky for a Disney to knock down. So, that's help. There's, there's, there's things helping May out, there's also things working against May in this matchup. That's bad. Very much win from. The thing is, that May could definitely win from an exchange. That's so much yeah, it it definitely feels like you don't want to let get Dizzy get started, but there are some ways out once once Dizzy is started. Ooh. Oh, Zach, oh, drops was, it. I, I wonder if a hoop would have won right there. Actually, at least Imperial, right? The harpoon what? is it gonna kill? No. Oh, yeah. oh, the <laughs> dolphin. <laughs> Or harpoon or knives, whatever. What do people call those knives, I think? I, I call it spear. That was a spear, right? The one that the little, little orb falls. When it's just... Yeah. But I don't know. I'm not a Disney player. It's probably called, like, the thing I used to fish. Her moves are weird. Her move days are actually Yeah, weird. they're amazing. I love them. Also, fun fact. I don't think I don't think when when you're... I'm pretty sure when Dizzy's... When you're not fighting Dizzy, Maze IK has Dizzy running in the thing. Yeah, I don't know if it replaces it with someone else, or if it just Dizzy just removed entirely. When you're IK Dizzy. Should be Johnny. <laughs> she the screen. Right. Um, the good thing is that I'm sure Dizzy super easy, right? She doesn't have the buns really to test after like a five wave or whatever. Oh, the Dizzy! Not, like I say, you, you win abruptly and randomly. <laughs> Jesus. Not oh, fish. <laughs> Dizzy's why I eat fish. Or at least that's my job. Oh, nice, nice bait. That would be beautiful. Yeah, not getting the good Oki, but still getting that JH to launch. That'd be the thing, yeah. Like, guns already on the table. Ooh, I think that was like when you throw someone in the corner, there's like a very specific like time you can do to get cross up. Yeah, I mean, he does that from all of her throws. I think she's the only character that can do from a ground throw. Where's Pulsar? Pulsar, um, yeah, he's here in commentary. And then he's going to be coaching a couple, of, a couple of the sets at the end. It's going to be interesting. My words are losing. 
Oily's doing a good job of keeping a, putting Athenia on the defensive immediately. Ooh, the 3k! Being goaded. I think about it, some of these weird things are not good. I swear to god, I haven't seen that setup since, like, reload. <laughs> Uh, oh, the uh, air throw! Did, wait, was that a soul steal? <laughs> it was a soul steal. Yes. Damn, you may have no, lost no. the round, but you stole the stole her soul. One of those clipping moments, and then prop it. Like one of those moments where like it's like an auto. <laughs> Ooh, the fish! Oh, interesting. We actually picked the normals. Yeah, you gotta throw it. You have to throw that move or get out of the way. Yeah, it, it, I think, yeah, I think it's gonna have a lot of trouble if she can't start reacting to these throws. Oh what? my god! Was yeah. that a misinput? <laughs> what the fuck? Where is that button on the stop? On the device? Getting punished for oh, it? Ah, yeah. oh, fish! <laughs> eating the yeah, super? Yeah, I was gonna wake up off the one. Ooh, is that gonna kill? No, it's not gonna kill. Are you trying to slash back it? Are you trying to be cheeky? Go for the slash back on the verse. All right, that is Athena on the board. I would honestly, I respect that slashback attempt. Like actually punishing him versus me is actually a nightmare. Yeah. Can you feel the love? Heaven or hell? Do one. Let's see the monsters here. Okay, oh. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> Those are like three exchanges that went heavily in all these favor. All the shit favor. Holy Jesus. Interesting choice to burst and not just accept your fate, but I mean, still, this could be a good cut. Oh. Yeah, I think that burst was a looking like it was a good choice. Mm. We're seeing so many deaths from both main players so far, and it's just like. It's always, it always makes me smile, I'm like, yeah, it's the best people. <laughs> Yo, Wacker, thanks it. for the follow. How many IKs are we at so far? Zero. Zero, yeah. See, these main players like to do these things called post-stun combos and not IK things, and it makes me kind of sad. <laughs> nice 2S, that was just a great reaction right there. Yeah. Ooh, good block. Yeah. So like, yeah. So why like Dizzy's 2S work so well? This like, like your 2S as an anti or is that a lot of maze moves actually don't hit into the floor, right? The only move actually like jumping normal actually hits into the floor is actually jump as. So if you have a low profiling move, a lot of the maze jumping normals will just whiff right over, uh, or it will just whiff. Well burst. Dizzy got all that meter. I'm guessing it's gonna be dead anymore, right? Not even. There. Oh, nice 6 on the dead anymore. I don't know what's up for that. Those are just terrifying May buttons. Ooh! 
all about the one is be on the, the movement of it. That, that didn't kill? Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we're at three one. Heaven or hell, do one. Let's rock. <laughs> Oily doing a lot of dolphin approaches. I imagine that there's probably some bigger punishes that uh, Nathaniel could be going for. I know that's one thing Kyle W has been trying to beat out of my skull is up dolphin neutral. Oh, it's doing all the time, or what? Yeah. It's very mi it's like minus 20 in here. I think you go with your murder. It's like force break as an approach tool, absolutely. Go for it, but like... The raw dolphin is will get you killed, for sure. Yeah. Ooh, we got the dizzy! Oh, I would have done. I, I was already imagining myself floating red right there. <laughs> Damn. I want that was a nice hoop setup. I wonder if that's um what kind of Watson setup for the post on for some of the lightweight stuff. Oh, I mean, I think it's just an extension. Ooh, yeah, dizzy yeah, showing off those throws. Oh, I love that. Like it looks like base bur bait that burst bait there. Okay, good thing it has like a random stun value too, right? Like there's like a, like a small variable to run it. That's why like Mei will, or not Mei, but Dizzy will randomly get stunned from one counter to 6p in this matchup. But not, it's not consistent. <sighs> they play it like that, Kiambra. They play it like that. Can't 6p a fish. I mean, you can 6p a fish. Man, fish just eating so many things that you don't have to. Oh man, it's so annoying. Ooh, good block. Yeah. Well, how many? We're just in Throw Tech City today. Ooh, 3k, Oh, Like, I'm noticing it seems like Athena's doing better at calling Oily when she makes those more risky moves. Oh, I like that overhead kiss. But, that's fine. Cause I'm noticing Oily, she's doing like some of those like just raw up dolphins, like those three Ks, and it's just like she's definitely increasing her risk to get in. Yeah, it sucks. Just basically trying to play as quickly as possible, basically. You know what I mean? Trying to get as much momentum. It's cause that's kind of that thing about this matchup too. Right? Like the moment Dizzy outpaces you, that's like the beginning of the end for me. Right? That means like, fishes will be on the table. So He's going as quick as he can, and killing her casually in the process, typically, hopefully. Nice two S's on all the vertical dolphins, by the way. That's, that's have been stellar. Oh. oh yeah, the overhead kiss reactions are getting better, like we're starting to throw techs involved. I can definitely see where Athena is adapting. Do May players not like their far slash? Um, it's like it's hard to combo off of. I sometimes am trying to start using some because it does have good range. Oh, it's really hard to confirm. Off of. it's, it's too sudden to like, confirm. You know, it goes on the 3k. It's a, it's, I use it all the time. It's still a good check. It's definitely a good check. I think it's, you, you can play her grounded, but a lot of people choose to, uh, be very versatile in the way you can play her. That's a good thing, right? Because her kit's is very kind of like, a generalist kind of a kit, so you play her in a lot of style. Avocado for Athenia. Nice. nice. 
Ah, the fish. Yeah, I know. I looked at Benya's earlier play, a very earlier set where like, the actual just get the fish, get the fish, get the fish out, right? And then was like, what do I do? What do I do? And I was, we haven't seen that kind of like just just go for like a raw finish, like just pretty much at neutral. I think it's a lot, a lot of has to do with how all of this kind of just smuggery, like just staying right in that range where uh, they get threatened with a 3k or something, where they don't the fish coming out. Yeah, see, yeah, that's the thing. This is very, very doable for me. <laughs> I don't think that makes me laugh. Like, this is one of those matches where, like, May's life part is irrelevant to this match. Like, it just ends so abruptly for Dizzy that, like... Like, life bar, I don't, don't even, I, you, you can put tape over May's life bar, it doesn't matter. Does it matter? <laughs> yeah, but yeah, I'm East Coast. I was up in the Pacific Northwest for a bit, though, so, um, plusy forever. Uh, Grinch Girl, if it's a charge 6P, it's like plus a 50 trillion bajillion. Bajillion, bajillion. Just some unimaginable number. Damn, Eden with first, and like, we're, we're even now. But, oh, oh no, we're gonna get, see... Benya gets an avocado. Now Oily gets an avocado. For those who don't know, I think like the Brazilians like to call it perfect some avocados because of the color of the bark. So. Okay. Yeah. Right. Like, I think a lot of things are working in the game. Like, like, um, I don't know we talk about how like Maze are really jumpy. Players are really, really jumpy, but in a lot of situations, it's kind of like added defense to May, right? Because she's a lightweight, right? A lot of combos that do hit May, but they don't give them the hard knockdown, right? And so, like, because when she does get hit, she gets hit, but she gets attacked, and so we don't keep momentum going on her. Nice block. Oh, that vertical block is checking the movement afterwards. Oh no. Oh no, is that gonna be another avocado? No, oh, <laughs> the throw! Denied. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, nice, nice, get him. Aw, oh, damn, yeah, catching the rest of rolling FRC. Yeah, like, a lot of it's just... It's very similar to the match we had with Ocean, right? Like, where Maze just not in a position to, like, get a knockdown that Dizzy really wants to, like, take advantage of, or can't take advantage of. Interesting dash in. Very peculiar. You! Nice showing, though. It's getting very wild. Yeah, they, they, like, well, so far, both very competitive sets. Yeah, yeah, they're they're all just they're playing the, they're playing their characters. That's how I would describe it. They're definitely playing their characters. Yeah, I think, yeah, it, it definitely feels like that Athena is able, I think is kind of starting to put Oily on the back foot. But yeah. It's like kind of weird, like, it's, the adaption's like there, but it's like, it's like subtle, like, it's like, you know what I mean, it's like, like... Because it looks very, it looks, still looks very much like the same to me in my opinion, but like, the way that the, the, the overall pacing of the match is like, kind of shifted. Dude, those two S's have been super on the fan, like, gotta get across. Ooh! Oh, this is the ice spear. Go oh, icicle. All right, that puts a fan you on set not point. Not fish number two. Not fish number two. <laughs> not fish number two. <laughs> uh, That's also another thing too we didn't really mention. Uh, a lot of Dizzy's like air options are like unstoppable for me. Like, they just cannot like just deal with her air options. So like you have to just draw neutral her to death basically. Because like at any point like May has to go defensive like your options are actually pretty weak. Yeah, and I'm looking yeah even using hoop cover for that up dolphin was still a, like I, I it, it's yep yep 
Oh, I missed the jump on the throw. I'm gonna really jump on the 6 H. Yeah, Oily got no burst, so that's been taken. Fine. Good FRC to make it safe, get it hit in. Great patience for the Benya right now. That's incredibly good patience. Just wrote it out, yeah. Nice air Ooh, throw. Oh, that's it. Like Five, three, Athenia. Oh, calculated. That's actually probably going to be a really effective message to send to all of right there. That was mm, a lot of control on your opponent. Yeah. <sighs> so next we got... So yeah, that that was... That, like, those adaptations, I guess, like you were saying, it was like Athenia really getting that fish out, and I guess just getting really good at that anti airs. And it did feel like that I think Oily was taking more risks than she needed to. Or I guess, I like... Right. Yeah, yeah. I think my image is that, like, those, there's so many 2S's that have been so consistent that it kind of made Olive kind of, like, really question what jumping normal should be using at any, any given moment, right? Like, how do I do this? And so I think that kind of, it's like the thought of more so about thinking about how to jump in that probably really slowed down Olive's game plan and it gave, uh, um, <clears throat> Athena, you know, a chance to just really accelerate their playstyle, right? It's just some subtle things, I think. It's, I mean, it could be a whole bunch of world things. We, don't, we can ask the players directly, but that was a really good set.